This afternoon we are with Henry Guerrero. We are at the Sacred Heart College in San Ignacio and he's one of our Rotary Scholars. Right now every year we have at least 24 students with a scholarship for high school. When they, we are committed to them and they are committed to us in order to uh, do or have a good behavior and also to keep their grades up. So let me introduce you Henry Guerrero, one of our best uh, scholars uh, on the Rotary Scholarship. Okay, well Henry, nice, nice meeting well, you. I'm, I'm, now, um, tell me about your, yourself and your, your family. Well, as um, I've been introduced, my name is Henry Guerrero. Um, I'm currently 19 years old and I live in the Santiago Juan Leot area here in San Ignacio. Um, right now, I'm attending Sacred Heart Junior College. My major is um, a dual degree between business and network administration. Um, I started high school back in 2007, I believe, and I received, of course, a Rotary Scholarship for the full four years. How did you get the scholarship, man? What did you have to do to get the scholarship? Well, to be honest, uh, after I graduated from primary school, I really didn't know how I was going to get into high school. And my mother, she got into contact with a lot of people. To be exact, I don't really remember who it was, but I know that someone uh, mentioned that Rotary offered scholarships, and we, from there on, we went to see what exactly we had to do to go about getting it. And after, you know, filling out all the proper paperwork and sending in the application, well, I was lucky enough to get it. What was that feeling like at home when you found out that you got the scholarship? I guess it would be one of those undescribable moments like, I mean, you know that it's really tough to get the finance to go into high school and then you think that, oh well, this is it for me, I can't go on, but then all of a sudden this ray of light or something like that um, just appears and you know that you have, given, you have been given this chance to continue your education. I felt like, um, okay, I got it, so I'm going to make the best of it and I did. You have dreams in life, right? All of us do have dreams in life. And at, at your age, 19, I was full of a lot of dreams. So I am sure that you must have dreams and goals and what you want to be in life. What's, what, what, what do you want to become? Um, well, one of my immediate dreams is basically to go into the university, get my uh, master's in um, network administration. Although I've been doing a dual between business and network administration, I have decided to continue the IT studies IT, before. So you're going to become an IT, IT technician? So. Yes, because honestly, there are a lot of people in business already. So I want to go into the area that, that the market is not as saturated so I can, you know, find a job. Anything I will you want make to tell sure. those Rotarians that are looking at you right now? Because a lot of them are looking at you right now. Especially President Alfonso, he's all smiles. Well, my advice is just do the best you can do. I mean, you've been given this opportunity that not many people get. I know there are a lot of people out there in the world that don't have the opportunity to um, continue their education after primary school. There are even a lot more people that don't even get to go to primary school. So you're one of the few in a world that has so many people. So make the best of it and, you know, just go and follow your dreams. That's right. I like to hear it. Nice meeting you. And all okay. the best to you. It's I hope pleasure. you succeed. In, and hope one day I'll bring my computer to repair to your computer repair. So, okay? <laughs> I'll make sure I do a good job. <laughs> <laughs> good. Thanks. Okay, thank all you. Right. Excellent.